Hi, <laughs> Collective. Welcome to the channel. I'm Crystal, Divine Psychic Medium, delivering messages to you from the higher realms. So, welcome in, everyone. Alright. So, I'm always going to let you know about the energies we're connecting with, what's going on in the cosmos. Energies of 8 to 1. Right? Start of Virgo season. Hmm. <laughs> So this is a very beautiful, still in this blue energy that's been coming in, especially with this epic blue moon that we just had. What's interesting, it was brought to my attention that there was there was two um, blue moons back to back, right? And that hasn't happened since '99, right? I was like, oh my gosh, that was so epic to find that out because I knew that there was something with these two these two alignments right we had the two full moons both in Capricorn season they're both in the sign of Capricorn in cancer season right and just a series of events the things that have been like processing like Virgo's this energy of like all right now that everything like in Leo season got like <laughs> so much revealed so much exposed passion action all of that and now we're in this um energy of practicality of planning now making all of those things work making those changes organization structure like it's it's right on time <laughs> you know it's like you could be partying for a while and having a lot of fun but then you reach that time where you're like okay <laughs> I gotta stop now. I have to get back to work. I've got to figure things out the plan. Not to mention the big reveal. For a lot of you, like, you had to go through things for healing purposes. And sometimes that looks like, I don't want to say this word, um, just doing things that you have to heal from or that other people have to heal from. Kind of getting your justice. Because some of you go out there and get your own justice right uh knight of swords is coming out here now that's some sort of fast movement right towards passion <laughs> okay if for some of you, you could have went and did something impulsively okay all right to always take whatever you feel is for you any part that's not fitting leave it out as these are collective readings okay if you do want a personal reading reach out to me down below all right, so I am going to be working on those again because it's time. So, <laughs> um, maybe for a lot of you, cycles have closed out. They're ending. Okay, which could have been a big influence. See, there was some sort of manipulation or control. You see how he has his hands in her. They're showing me from the new Deadpool movie, too. And Cartwright puts the fingers, like, in the right, the brain and manipulates, right? It's straight up what it looks like to me. Can see everything. Like, for a lot of you, like, the enemy, okay, was able to pull on wounds, like, deep memories, things that are, were in your subconscious okay and leading you and guiding you for a lot of you you're really breaking out of like traditions patterns just really things that were pulling you down a certain way a limited belief system right so, you know that's why a lot of times you have to get out of your current situation to see your worth to see what you're capable of doing because you'll let other people's perceptions of you influence like what you're doing and and the projecting and just almost oh, so much stuff happens, right? So there's this big change here. Yeah, look, cycles are closing for sure. Nine of Wands and Nine of Swords. This was a very challenging and difficult time, right? Um, very painful cycle, right? Whoops. We got two queens here with temperance. Something got balanced out. See, this was so much because this had to do with your legacy. You were on like, um, you were really pushing through a barrier to fight for what was yours, like your destiny. Seven of swords and two of swords. 
You had some difficult decisions to make. What I'm getting with that Seven of Swords is like you were hiding out. You were deceiving yourself. You were being the Seven of Swords. Like I said, if that's not you, don't pick it up. But you were wearing a mask to others that you were around. You were cloaking yourself. You were hiding, protecting. Look at that owl hiding there. So you were very vulnerable. Nine of Pentacles. Like, you were moving very slow. I don't know what I'm feeling with that. You were healing. It's like you were wearing a mask, okay? You were like down a pathway in a situation you weren't supposed to be down. But you were healing there. And you found love there. Ace of Cups, Six of Wands. There's a major victory and success. What I woke up hearing was like, I baited you. Somebody's realizing like, you know you put yourself in a situation to like bait you know how the some of the shows like um will trap people they'll put on disguise or the you know what i mean but are being watched and monitored <laughs> like for some <laughs> you knew you were being watched and monitored by the higher ups and i don't mean from this realm okay and you brought some people <laughs> like in a way, you got attention on you by what you brought, by what you did. This is somebody that really leveled up by bringing something. But see, it's beautiful because it's justice exactly at its finest, you know? Like something was brought like this because... I don't know if it was always written that way. If you took over someone's contract, what happened here? But wheel with the high riff. See? This is totally changes your destiny. Now someone's proven to be worthy of being a creator. So you really had to go against a lot. <laughs> And not get caught up. <laughs> and all of it with all the nine of swords. Seven of wands. Mm -hmm. You had strong boundaries. You were very grounded. Right? This is someone I feel that leveled up to the last phases very fast. And took on extreme. Like, because it. Maybe they knew. It's just so perfect, right? With all the Leo energy the sevens that are coming out here the red the fire the energy them i read intuitively right so it's not about the cards i like i can even read without cards <laughs> okay all right there's definitely a clarity here it's the eight of swords nine of cups Ace of Wands, because she's such at peace. That Nine of Cups energy is so beautiful, loving, caring. Just, you know, when a person is loved right, how much they shine. Like, you can tell if somebody's loved right by how they carry themselves, by how that they are. Like, if a woman has to be in the masculine energy in a relationship, you can tell. You can tell. Right? And it takes away from the feminine energy. It takes away from the balance. So if you're not providing equal, you're not going to be getting that. That's why it's so beautiful to level up to divine status where you're attracting a divine. So if you are a divine and you're not with the divine, then you're out of alignment. That's it. Okay. Release. Three of Wands. Because what is for you is literally already there. Because, you know, there everything's a mirrored reality. You just got maybe caught up. <laughs> maybe you were, maybe you're needing to be told, like, it's time for advancement. Six of Pentacles, it's time for things to be fair. Hmm, that's what it is. Four of Pentacles. Like, you've been, like, waiting, like, um. 
Is this someone that almost knows like what's destined for them, but they're like, wait, let me take care of some stuff first. Wow. It's this nine of wands energy. What I think though, yeah, the magician. So I was gonna say, it's like somebody like creates this. It's like they like this nine of wands energy. Let me get this off my screen. Because it's like somebody that's used to being in like survival mode. Okay. They they stay in this up energy. So they don't like it when it's complacent and when it's calm. Right? There's a um there's this energy of like someone that just needs things to be going, but maybe it's like changing passion in other ways, right? <laughs> Like, if you're one where you always like things going on, like, move around. Maybe that's why if you're complacent and staying in, like, the same place. You're not supposed to be there. You're supposed to be traveling, doing things, right? So. Alright, let's find out more about what's going on. And then I'm going to do some other readings. So, watch whatever you feel guided to. I always try to upload in threes. Okay. So I'm um, going to definitely be pulling some more cards on this blue moon energy because it's extremely powerful. We're still just 48 hours out when I'm creating this. Um, well, the seven of swords is coming out very strong. So like you're either being exposed. <laughs> I feel like you are. Um, it's this energy. It's time to take action. Queen of Cups, the Magician, and Ace of Pentacles with the Queen of Pentacles right here. Wow. See this Three of Swords. Like, you know that you're going to go through a loss, an ending, right? That's going to affect your heart because this is... It's with someone close to you. That's what matters at the heart, Okay. But it's this energy like you've created something new. You have this new beginning. It's an abundant new beginning. And I, you're stepping into it with the unknown. I feel you were unaware that you even created this. She's blindfolded here. With the magician. You did this fully out of faith. You created something. I, yeah, look at this Queen of Cups. She had to wear three, look at the three different sides of the face. Like, you wore different masks and different energies, just like I'm calling you out with the Seven of Swords. But you did it in the most beautiful way because you did it in a protective way. Like, you were wearing a mask, but you were doing it to, like, protect others. You know, it changes the way you look at the mask. That, that's the type of energy that I'm getting. Like, you, like, lied under cover, but, like, you weren't after it for just, like, justice. You weren't after it for, like, I'm going to get paid for this. I'm going to get justice. Like, I'm going to get, like, like a Robin Hood type of energy is what they're showing me. That's why you, you knew you were doing things differently. And now this Ace of Pentacles is here for you. Like, your rewards are here. They're, like... It's time to come out now, Robin. <laughs> Just You have this new pathway, right? I feel it's changing. That's why they wanted you to come out. Of, yes. I'm, ooh, Ace of Swords. It lets you know when I'm on point, but also it's this new look. Even the swords down, the butterfly is illuminating and lighting up and carrying the sword. For some of you, it's like realizing you've reached that level. You have help now. It's the final decision's not up to you. Like, because it's like uh, those otherworldly things. Yeah, like the world. Those cycles are being closed out. Remember, I was saying that it's like it caught the attention of God. Right? Since the beginning of the shooting. Because you're being seen, watched, monitored, you could be noticing a lot. Oh my gosh, look, another ace. 
or no, this is the King of Pentacles. I thought it was another. I thought it was yeah. another ace. This King of Pentacles could be bringing, because I put it right on top of the Ace of Swords. It could be what's bringing communication. This, um, <laughs> four of Swords, Four of Cups just came out. Two Fours. See, there was a missed opportunity here because somebody didn't heal. I feel it's what, yeah, that's why there's an ending here. Or somebody healed from something and now, like, it's a missed opportunity either way. Like, I get in it's like there was like a contract where two hurt people are supposed to heal each other. It was supposed to be something very beautiful. I feel one stayed in longer. The healing didn't happen on the other side. Yeah, unawakened, high priestess reverse. Like, somebody just would not awaken, so they were out of alignment. Eight of Wands. Now things are moving fast. Because whoever this was that didn't heal, like, well, whoever did all of the work attracted what they deserve. The match to their energy yes. and awaken. And um, maybe that's why, like, maybe there has been like a third party. Three masks. Philip was called in. It's getting ready to communicate. I was feeling the Ace of Wands there. Here it is. <laughs> So now we have three aces. Three aces. See? Seven of Pentacles with the Hierophant. This was definitely a contract. Because of what happened in this contract is also, this is a contract that is, that, you know, they don't always, every contract's not always the completion, you know? <laughs> and so there needed to be, it needed to get see, overseen. Like, look at this, right? Like, look at this contract, like, it's changed confirmation. Like, it needs to change, it's not fair. It's. That, you know what I mean? Like, if you do the work and you do what you're supposed to do, like, it's not fair for you to be punished, right? And not get what you are working on. You deserve a king of cups. You're the queen of cups. You deserve a king of cups. So you're getting that king of wands. Or maybe the situation involved what was supposed to be your match, but now you're getting a king of wands. Oh, snap. Judgment. Page of swords. I told you there's been... There's strategies at work there. Maybe this was your strategy to bring in your justice. Maybe that's these fairy tale stories. Like some get the fairy tale. <laughs> Queen of Wands. Now that's the match to the King of Wands. You see what I mean? Like this is a match. I'm going to stop. Nine of Cups, Page of Swords, Eight of Wands. See, you've been in this beautiful Nine of Cups energy. Even amongst this. So even though all of this was going on, something was compromised to come at you and you still released it with love. Like I said, you did it in a beautiful way. Three of Cups. So that's why you were wearing the mask. You were strategy and playing. You were also being the Page of Swords. What? <laughs> you know... It's taken survival level. It's a, it's beautiful. Whoever's following this, you know what I mean. Like, okay, eight of wands. Things are coming fast now. Oh, this is definitely somebody getting like to create something, and it is beautiful. 
on so many levels. I'm going to leave this here right at 20 minutes. So 2000. <laughs> All the zeros, God for a slumber. Like this is divinely orchestrated and planned. And it planned. It's, it's unfolding for you. And what's beautiful, you know, is I woke up to like you baited them. Like because you were always being watched monitored so it's like wow <laughs> love and light to all of you bye